Hello everybody. Um, just wanted to do this little quick disclaimer thing before the video, before the intro. Uh, a couple things about the experience. Um, one, the video that you're going to see, it's uh, definitely, I knew going in that the cars would be limited, but I just looked at the video and it looks a lot slower than it is, or than I thought it was. Um, but I knew they would be limited, obviously, because they don't want people to get hurt and they don't want them to wreck their cars and stuff, but I've had that thing, you know, matted and it still looked pretty slow, so uh, I was going as fast as the car would go and uh, I was running in the middle of the track, which they told us to do. I went to the wall without thinking about it on the on the first lap going down the back stretch because you know on iRacing and just watching races that's what you do you go to the wall to get your speed and I went to the wall and the spotter was telling me to get back to the middle of the track so we had to run the middle and uh, the uh, when I took off these cars only had second third and fourth gear so the takeoff was a little slower but uh, they restricted the cars pretty good, but still, still a lot of fun. Uh, definitely a good experience to have. Uh, definitely makes me want to go racing even more. But maybe one day. Um, gonna, I think I'll probably end up going back and doing it again. Maybe at different tracks, but definitely something I want to do again. Uh, I just woke up and was looking at the, the videos and trying to put it all together. So just wanted to say those few things. A disclaimer, the cars were more limited than I thought, but it was still a lot of fun. Uh, we couldn't really run a complete racing line, which, you know, all that stuff's understandable, but just wanted to say that. And uh, last thing is the, we bought the in-car footage package where the GoPro was on the car, and they checked it after the, the 10 laps that I ran, and it didn't work, so uh, there's no footage from on top of the car which sucks all i have is the clips from uh you know friends and family uh, four people that were allowed um just from their view from pit road so unfortunately there's no in car footage on this video but hopefully it's still um, entertaining and i guess helpful if you were you're thinking about getting a racing experience what you uh, what you might be getting um but hope you guys enjoyed thank you guys for watching and i'll let the rest of the intro play now so hope you enjoy it hello everybody and welcome back um, we've got another well this is actually i don't know if i'll use the same intro for both videos but we got two different things going on today we got a ride along or not a ride along a drive along at new hampshire motor speedway and a uh, we're going to stafford and i'm going to be vlogging both of those it's going to be two different videos uh, so i don't know if i'll make different intros or not this will probably be used for both of them but it's 4 55 right now and we're heading to loudon got to be there at 6 30 and then seven and then i don't know the whole schedule but we got a 45 minute training that i got to do and then it goes from there i don't really know but uh, i'm gonna keep you updated throughout the day and, uh, got a gopro footage at the track so or a gopro package at the track so uh, there'll be some video of it hopefully you guys enjoy yeah so just got to the track 6 30 uh, waiting in line, gotta sign a waiver to get onto the property, I guess, with Corona and everything. So, waiting to do that. I think I'm gonna have to get out because they just went back to their car. So, I think I gotta get out. So, I think I gotta get out and sign the waiver. Uh, 6 30, thing starts at 7. So, we got a little bit, but wanted to get here early so I don't miss anything important. So, uh, I'll let you know.
just pulled up to the garage where we're parking. There's a look at all the cars. Uh, modified, that'd be pretty cool, but I think I'm signed up for a COT. Can't really see what's on the other side, but at least on this one there's a Junior, a Kyle Busch, and then there's that uh, Rusty Wallace looking one, so yeah. Just got signed in, uh, headed to the class now. Look at the grandstands, a little foggy out. Gotta be to Stafford uh, at some point today. Otherwise, because uh, they had mods and I would have done that. But I'll come back another time and do a modified, hopefully. But uh, heading in now, so I'll keep you guys updated. Uh, just finished up the training, driver's meeting kind of thing. Uh, headed to get the fire suit, helmet and all that stuff now. And we got a ride along to see the lines and stuff. And I think we're in, so stay tuned. up the uh, the ride along uh, 
I've got 10 laps. Unfortunately, the car camera didn't record, so the only uh, video we're gonna have is gonna be from that guy. Right that I pointed to the window. So he's got the video. It's not good, it's on him, so make sure to roast him in the comments. But all in all, pretty great. They're definitely limited a lot, like more than I thought they were gonna be, but uh, 10 laps goes by fast. A lot of fun. Definitely recommend doing it if you can. I'm, we're gonna do it. I'm gonna do it again next year now. I uh, saw a guy that owns three cars at Stafford, so talked to him for a little bit. It's pretty cool because that's where we're going next. And, uh, we're gonna hit the road. That's it for this one, and we'll uh, keep you updated on the Stafford one. So thank you for watching.